zoom back out in 3D as well and over to that location so you can see it. So let, the other way would be extract from graphics, let's say selection method, and we'll do a stormwater. Um, we'll just do a stormwater culvert sign circular. And then my feature definition for um, my node will be a head wall. I'll just do a free, so it's no, it doesn't really have a head wall. So it's gonna be a, a dummy point, if you will. So I'm gonna use the selection method, select that, reset. I am gonna use the 3D elevation because they are correct. I'm not gonna move it further down than that. And you can see in 3D. So if it was a head wall there, you know, those head, Head walls might vary in size. You don't have enough cells in your cell library to mimic every potential existing condition. So maybe they come back now and add two cells there or two nodes that that model that uh, existing location. So you can do it. There's a couple ways to do to do that. So that that's kind of you know creating stuff from from graphics. Um, again, we're paying close attention to our feature definitions and, and our cells that are being used and, and how they get constructed in 3D. And just keep in mind there will be um, cleanup. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like. If you want to see more such series, consider subscribing to our channel. Thank you and see you next time.